Hi guys, George here from Zero Period Productions, and today on Skyrim Saturday Mods, we're causing some trouble in the Court of Solitude in Unmasking Sybil by the Oscar Zero. Just a few months ago, we played another of Oscar's quest mods, Meridia's Order, adding a new faction and questline in which we aim to thwart an insidious necromantic plot taking place across Skyrim. Today's mod is smaller in scale, but aims to add some more depth to existing characters in the game. Sabeel Stentor, Court Mage of Solitude, has always been a pretty obvious vampire to us, the player, but it's not as evident to those around her. In this mod, you get the opportunity to investigate her, find evidence of her affliction and her plans, and ultimately, decide her fate. The mod is fully voiced, using existing lines within the game, as well as splicing, but it doesn't make use of any AI. It is ESL flagged, does not require a new game, and it should be compatible with just about anything out there. The mod is available for Skyrim Special Edition, for both PC and Xbox. To get started, speak with Melorin the Wizard or Odar the Cook about Sibyl, or you can even launch immediately into looking for evidence of her deeds all on your own. Sibyl Stentor has a grasp of magical theory that I would never have expected from a human, even a Breton. So, what's your job here then? I make sure Erica keeps breathing. Are you the court wizard? No, that honor is Sibyl Stentor's. A smart woman steers clear of Stentor and keeps herself out of the dungeon when she's having a bad day. Mm? What do you mean? Let's just say that the headsman's axe may not be the worst way for a solitude jail prisoner to die. Look at that. I've told you to watch your tongue, and mine is waggling. I've said enough. <laughs> well, I appreciate it. You know, let's talk. Let's have, uh, some tea. Let's share the solitude tea. The Dawn Guard are apparently focused on exterminating vampires. Noble and brute alike. I am sorry I cannot provide you with further help. But this conversation requires a great deal of effort on my part. I suppose you are... kind of putting yourself in harm's way by saying any of this. Can you provide evidence of her secret? I can't. If I do, I may as well cut my own throat. I told you the headsman's axe may not be the worst way for a solitude jail prisoner to die. Go on. Alright, okay. You know I could protect you. I don't think you understand. I'm not answering questions. You are free to leave. <laughs> right, he's like, can you stop asking? This is a really uh, dangerous position you're putting him in. Splicing is very well done so far. There was like one moment where you could tell it was a splice, but it didn't sound so unnatural that it's, honestly, it's not even really all that worth mentioning, frankly. I've heard more awkward kind of like pauses or like little hiccups in vanilla lines compared to that. Something just ain't right about that Sabeel. Mm -hmm. You know, I've never seen her eat a thing. That can't be natural. Well, you know, summer's coming up. You gotta make sure you're uh, ready for the beach. Is there a reason, aside from the ones you just mentioned, that you don't trust Sabeel? Yes, I suppose there is. Folks at court won't admit it, but Sibyl Stentor scares us all to death. One thing about living in Skyrim I could never stomach. All the damn vampires. A vampire? Are you sure? Of course I am. What do I look like, a tavern wench? Well, my kind of wench. Any advice for finding proof? Do you have any proof? Well, no. <laughs> but that's not the point. Looks dead to me. I mean, she does. I'm so glad that other people might finally notice. Any advice for finding proof? I wish I could tell you. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. All right. All right. Back to slicing, dicing, and baking. If anything, it's one of the ways in which actually benefits Skyrim that there's so many repeated voice actors. It makes stuff like this easier because, oh, I need the cook to have these lines. Well, I can borrow lines from it's this merchant, that merchant, from same person uh, who voiced 
Fog fire beer. See, the crossover makes it a lot it easier to manipulate well. the lines, giving you more Let's lines that you can use, more lines that you have. Oh, well done. Very subtle. To manipulate. I beg your pardon. Oh, you're. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I imply that you'd be meeting for purposes other than court business? You must forgive me. Oh, you're supposed to be a court Hold right now. Wizard. Or you're likely to lose it. You're supposed to be talking to them I right now. I should very much like to see you try it, my dear steward. I'm gonna look around. Stop it, both of you. You're acting like children. I'm just gonna take a quick look around, if you don't mind. There doesn't seem to be anything <clears throat> in her room. I guess she would maybe want to hide the evidence elsewhere. I also checked her. There's nothing in her pockets either. <sighs> Hmm. Well, they keep on mentioning the prison. They keep on mentioning the dungeons. So maybe we should check there. I'm going to take a quick look around the rest of the Blue Palace first. I wonder what happens if I call him a coward. Absolutely no time to deal with lowlifes these days. Go away. You know what? Fair. <laughs> you are free to leave. You know what? I, I can't say I blame him. Well, I see a dead body in this cell. Uh, I should maybe sneak for this, but... It's a thing of, I'm not going to remember who's normally in here dead and who's not, so this may take me a second, but... You know. Bam. Oh, here we go. Yep, drained prisoner with a scribbled note. Whoever finds this, I'm so weak, I know I'm done for. All I did was steal some food from the market. I don't know what I did to deserve this. The court wizard is a vampire. Please don't let her do this to anyone else. She's taken everything from me. I can't feel my hands. Why can no one hear me screaming? I can't hold on much longer. I think I ran out of ink. Also, um, I think I mentioned this. Oh, that's a note. Oh, never mind. This is unrelated. Sorry. Nope. That's gonna be probably Creation Club. I can't remember the 87 things they added to Creation Club. Can you? But what I was gonna say is that there is no uh, quest mark for this. There is no quest that you have pop up. This is a miscellaneous quest. But honestly, I feel like that works in this situation, I think this works out well for the kind of mod that it is. I don't know about you, but I, for one, I loved finding some of the miscellaneous and unmarked quests in something like Fallout 3 back in the day. There's the one town that you find just outside DC where it's the two families and they're cannibals and they've been inbreeding and all that. And that entire quest is unmarked. It is really up to you to find stuff, to investigate, to figure stuff out. And once again, it can work really well for certain types of quests. Youngest it bar does work really, college. really well at in some service. scenarios. And I think this being a smaller kind of bite-sized side experience, it's a really good way to handle it. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. So we do have the two endings for this, one of which is turning her in, the other is if we choose to side with her. So let's start by seeing what happens if we go to Falk Firebeard. That's quite a bold claim. I'd need proof before I could possibly accept it. Does the word of a dying prisoner count? <clears throat> You what? I, I broke she's in, yeah. Beard. She's she's a vampire. <clears throat> oh, 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 there she is. Are oh, you with oh, me? oh, there she is. Yes, there sir. she is. By order of the Jarl. Stop right there. Was that her yawning? On threat of what exactly? This city wouldn't run without me. Now if you'll excuse me, my work awaits. What's all the commotion? She's a vampire. You liar. How dare you? It's all in this note. Come quietly, or taste the Jarl's justice. I should very much like to see you try it, my dear steward. Oh god, what if she kills him? That's it. I'm placing you under arrest. Oh, what if he just dies? You everything. I will drink your blood and feast on your flesh. At least she admitted to it. Vampire! Fane Bryling, at your service. Oh, 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 we gotta kill her, we gotta kill her. Oh, oh, I'm just, I'm a little worried, because I don't want to hit anyone. 
Oh god, what if she turned Erica into a vampire? <laughs> hey, hey, hey! She was yielding! She was yielding! She surrendered! Where's your honor? Oh, that's right, Stormcloaks. Thank you for your role in all of this. Don't mention it. Here, this is for you. Oh, wait, oops, sorry. Here, this is for you. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh... You're welcome, thank you. I won't forget what you've done for Solitude. Right, just... It's a fine day with you around. You may need to, uh, you know... Do you have Put out some feelers for a new court wizard. Alright, well I'm just gonna take her gold. She's not gonna be needing it, now is she? Out of curiosity... I can always find time to share a word with a will warrior. Will they have... Oh, he's gone. Melorin? I just wanted to see if he had anything to say. Oh, uh, him and the cook, yeah. So I might just wait a little bit just to see where they are, just to see if I can <laughs> talk to them. The Jarl is not to be No doubt most folk in Skyrim consider the dragons terrifying. I find me. them wondrous. So, it would seem a place in court seems to suit you. It does indeed. You know, I hear you had something to do with Sibyl Stentor's demise. Well... That must have been a hard bit of business. I hear Stentor had been alive for a long, long time. <coughs> I wonder if he would say if he's the court wizard now. Let's see. Now that Sibyl Stentor is out of the picture, I am indeed. And the court is, well, free of her eccentricities. There you go. Moving into her quarters was an interesting process. You are free to leave. Man, I, I just put him Fame in charge. Or at your service. Not in charge, but I just made him court wizard and he still just wants me to get out of here. He still just wants me to leave. The disrespect. <sighs> Most of the time, people just forget I'm even here. That's why I hear so much good gossip. Like Sibyl being a vampire? Jarls come and Jarls go. But a good cook stays for a lifetime. And I'm a very, very good cook. I guess it would make sense that he doesn't have as much to say about it. He was freaked out by her, but he also doesn't have to interact with her, didn't have to interact with her as much necessarily. All right, let's see what happens uh, if we side with her. Is it that time again already? It's so good to see you again. Let's meet this evening oh, and make uh, your eyes are extra vampiric today, aren't they? I know what you are. Let me guess. You have some business to discuss. Something like that. You are a vampire. How dare you? I, Listen, it's true. You impudent cur. I'm Seville Stentor. You're going to turn up missing if you keep up this kind of talk. I always do find it funny, though, in games when people can never seem to tell. It was the same thing when I started playing Baldur's Gate 3 of Yamita yeah, Starian, and it's like, oh, the guy just screams vampire, frankly, and it's like, oh my god. The first time you find out when he tries to bite you, it's like, who could have known? Whoever could have guessed? Others know, too. I can see it in your eyes. It's obvious. Uh, <laughs> I'd say you're either brave or stupid but I can already tell which one it is. You do realize there's only one way this can end. I won't tell anyone, but you need to stop hunting in solitude. You'll pay for all the lives you've taken. I want to go through all these options, so I may need to reload just to go through these. I won't tell anyone, but you need to stop hunting in solitude. A risky game to play, friend. Very well. How does a vampire come to be in solitude's court? Over the years, I've heard things. Powerful magics lost to the ages. That power certainly exists, I assure you. And I'm also aware of how necessary my divinations and wards have been in the city's defense. My experiments are all I ask for in return. Besides, filthy creatures, aren't they? Living in the darkness like they do. So uncivilized. I prefer finery, like this. Alright, let's reload and go through the other options. It's so good to see you again. Oh, you're not going to be saying that for long. Let me guess. You have some business to discuss. Hold your tongue, wizard. How dare you? Because what I want to see is... I'm Sibyl Stentor. 
you're going to there's, a, there's quite a few options that we had, so I really want to see how this goes. I want to see what happens if I say that I have the evidence. I see you've already taken it upon yourself to gather the information you seek. You do realize there's only one way this can end. Okay, so I feel like the three options there will lead to just the same thing no matter what. Don't worry, I'll keep your secret. Why would that be? No, don't tell me. I don't want to know. Look, we need to keep this quiet between you and me, okay? No one else needs to know about it. Thank you. Here, this is for you. Oh, a diamond, thank you. I wonder what would happen to... Well, I, I don't know if anything would happen to anyone else, because I haven't indicated that anyone else knows aside from the evidence I gave her. There's a couple different ways this can go, huh? Remember, this is between us now. I'm Seville Stentor. You're going to turn up missing if you keep up this kind of talk. Others know you're a vampire too. I want to know if someone else goes missing. I want to know if she's going to kill someone else. Do they? How delightful. You do realize there's only one way this can end. Oh? Um, I just, I'm going to do this to see if anything happens to the others. I haven't said who knows, but I'd just be curious. Why would that be? No, don't tell me. I don't want to know. Look, we need to keep this quiet between you and me, okay? No one else needs to know about it. Thank you. Here, this is for you. Yeah, what I'll do is I'll wait a couple Remember, days. Remember, this is between us now. I'll wait a couple days in game, see if anything happens. <laughs> or I'll even see if maybe I have new dialogue with Melorin. <clears throat> There you are. Sibyl Stentor has a grasp of magical theory that I would never have expected from a human. Okay, Even he a doesn't have anything new to say. You are well, free to leave. Yeah, let's see if you're still alive in a couple days. In three days. I'll give you three days to die. Well, he's still alive. Sibyl Stentor has a grasp of magical theory that I would never have Which expected from a human. Would Even mainly a just Folks be a matter of... But Sabil Stentor scares us all to death. It would mainly just be a matter of if you're all not right. telling her Back who slicing, dicing, thinks and baking. she's a vampire, she wouldn't have, you know, any idea of who to kill. Also, it might just be slightly suspicious. It, be quick. I have little patience for mundane concerns. Man, oh man, I just saved your life, you know. You do realize there's only one way this can end. I do hope this ends in me killing her the same way that if I go to Falk, uh, Firebeard, that it ends in her death. You'll pay for the lives you've taken. No, and I'm not about to either. You should have listened. Guards! Help! Trespasser! Uh-oh. Oh, oh, no, you don't! Oh, oh if she attacked- since she attacked me first, I... Huh. Yeah, she attacked me first, so I still get away with it. I'm still fine. Huh. This is gonna be me, you know, essentially giving the mod author more work to do, and they don't have to do anything I say, obviously, but uh, already I've got some ideas on how you could kind of change up that ending, which I'll just go into that in the review Please address fast. all questions to Lady the gods, watch oh, over your battles, friend. Okay, I was mainly wondering if he was going to have anything to say, or if I could maybe give him the note afterwards, being like, oh, by the way, this is why I had to kill her, this is why this all happened. I won't forget what you've done for Solitude. Like, kill your court wizard, yeah. No doubt most folk in Skyrim consider the dragons terrifying. I find them wondrous. And you should now be the court wizard again. Or, you know, technically for the first time. It does indeed. You know, I hear you had something to do with Sibyl Stentor's demise. Yeah, I just brutally murdered that her in the other room. That must have been a hard bit of business. I hear Stentor had been alive for a long, long time. All right. You are free to leave. Yeah, well, you know, do you have you're welcome. With the court? <laughs> you're welcome for your new position. 
I really like these types of mods, and we've been lucky to see a lot of mods of this style from Jay Serpa, who I've covered several times on the channel before, most notably in my Skyrim Special Edition modded playthrough. To me, something like this serves as a great addition to a save game, adding a bit more depth and interaction to already existing characters. And while this isn't a recreation of it at all, it does remind me a bit of the cut Boethia quest in which you would kill Jarl Elisif. Really, the only connection here is that both events take place in the Court of Solitude, but for me, the court politics, the intrigue, and such is something that I would have loved to see leaned into much more in the vanilla game. But for players who wanted more interaction with Sibyl, to not only finally acknowledge in-game that she's a vampire, but for other characters to as well, this mod finally does it. It worked very smoothly, with the different endings depending on your own moral alignment. It's really seamlessly integrated into the rest of the game, and as a result, it feels like a natural addition to it. There are a couple ways that I could see this being taken to the next level, but it would require much more work from the author, and I'm not sure how easily existing lines could be spliced to even make some of it possible. The big one that I'm thinking of is if confronting Sibyl led to your arrest, and then having her try to kill you in prison like she does her other victims, only for you to be able to fight back and obviously win. I do wish that we could go to Falk Firebeard with the evidence should we confront her or kill her ourselves. And I would maybe like if there was an ending where she kills Melorin, but it also makes sense that doing so might raise too much suspicion. All in all, this is a great addition to your game. It's something that's super compatible with other mods, and ultimately it won't have a huge impact on the rest of your game. It doesn't seem like Melorin provides the same court wizard services that Sibyl would, so that might be one of the only downsides to killing her. But that is going to be all for today. As always, thank you for watching. If you'd like to support the channel, check out the Patreon or the YouTube memberships, both of which get access to the Discord server. YouTube members also get access to the channel emotes, which can be used in the comments below. And make sure to check out the streams at twitch.tv slash zero period productions. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.